Chapter 6 Dhyana Yoga At the end of chapter 5 Krishna briefly mentioned the system of Ashtanga Yoga the strict regulated focused regime of an ascetic yogi In the present day millions of people worldwide practice elements of this path primarily as hatha yoga and pranayama which offers benefits for physical and emotional well-being in this chapter the path of ashtanga yoga is explained in its entirety essentially krishna's purpose in discussing the eight stage path is simply to establish its impracticality for the purpose of self realization and spiritual perfection in an age surcharged with temptation and distraction the easiest and the topmost path of self realization is bhakti yoga bandharatma atmanas tasya yenaatma eva atmana ajitam anatmanas tu shatrutve vartetaatma eva shatruvat for him who has conquered the mind the mind is the best of friends but for one who has failed to do so his mind will remain the greatest enemy e for enemy or friend a for ashtang yoga s success and failure y yogi verses 1 to 9 take the theme of enemy or friend e during our sojourn in this temporary world we are perpetually accompanied by the voice within yes we have all experienced it the devil on one shoulder and the angel on the other each giving their own choice to the confused person in between the mind is that voice within essentially a storehouse of memories and experiences that offers options to the individual an uncontrolled mind will agitate misguide and entangle the soul within this world forcing us to succumb to our lower nature of lust anger and greed the controlled mind on the other hand acts as a friend on our spiritual journey helping us to make progressive and healthy choices which bring us closer to god when one controls and befriends the mind one experiences tranquility peace and freedom from the duality of happiness and distress the theme of verses 10 to 36 is ashtanga yoga a one way to control the mind is through the process of ashtanga yoga which includes dhyana yoga the practice of meditation Krishna explains the ancient path as it was practiced in the bygone ages living in seclusion practicing celibacy and under strict regulations of eating and sleeping the yogi would sit in a perfectly erect pose focusing his consciousness on the super soul within despite mental and bodily distractions the yogi would meditate in this way for many years maintaining stillness and complete silence hearing about this strict discipline Arjuna admits his amazement. This practice seems impractical and unendurable, he exclaims. To discipline the mind is more difficult than to control the raging wind. Krishna reasserts that disciplining the mind is essential. And that is possible through appropriate practice and detachment. The theme of verses 37 to 45 is success and failure, S. Hearing about the difficult Ashtanga yoga process raises a new concern for Arjuna. What happens if one faithfully takes to this yogic process but later falls away without perfecting his spiritual consciousness? This unsuccessful spiritualist is seemingly left in no man's land having failed to attain spiritual satisfaction and simultaneously squandered his opportunities for worldly pleasure. Krishna appeases all such fears by explaining that whoever takes up a genuine spiritual process is eternally benefited even if they don't perfect it if we don't complete it in one lifetime we can carry on in the next life from the same point and the individual thus evolves towards spiritual perfection the theme of verses 46 47 is why yogi after summarizing the arduous process of dhyana meditation and ashtanga yoga the chapter concludes with a ray of hope krishna way affirms that the perfection and goal of all yoga systems is to help the individual become fully conscious of god at all times while all yoga systems are certainly beneficial the easiest most efficient and essential path is known as bhakti yoga the yoga of devotion in this age 
the primary practice of bhakti yoga is mantra meditation chanting the names of god hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare hare through this process any person from any background can attain spiritual perfection and experience all the benefits described in this chapter and elsewhere yogi naam api sarvesham श्रद्धा